Chow Chin Chow, Slanturn Joe here and welcome back to another episode of the Transfer Guide, a series on my channel where I look at how simple it is to transfer Pokemon from previous games to Sword and Shield. Today we are looking at the 6th generation, we are looking at Pokemon X and Y, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. So we're going to see how simple and how easy it is for me to go and catch a Pokemon uh, that is uh, available for me to actually put onto Sword and Shield and then actually do said uh, do exactly that. So here I am on I'm in Camp Reader Town and uh, it's Route 7. I need a Pokemon that would I need a Pokemon. Okay, so where where can I go to get a decent good Pokemon that could probably uh, test my theories of how simple it is here in X and Y? All right, here's the daycare. Can I find anything here? You can't come to X and Y. Hey. Yeah, you can't come to X and Y, Volby. You're not in the uh, you're not in the sword and shield decks. Can't use you. What I need is someone's in the sword and shield decks, which is not Volbeat. Spritzy. Okay, Spritzy works. Spritzy's in the sword and shield decks. Yeah, I'm okay with Spritzy. Spritzy's in the sword and shield decks. Is it? I swear, Aromatis is in the sword and shield decks. Now I need to look this up. Yeah, I swear it is. I swear it is. I'm going to... You know what? I'm going to say it is. I know Slurpuff is, so I've got to say the other, the other one is, right? Yeah. I'm going to say Splitsy's in the decks. Alright, we got Splitsy. All right, we got Splitsy. Um, what do I want to call you? Um, you know what? I'm gonna call you Boss. No, 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 Hugo Boss. Hugo Boss. There we go. Hugo Boss. Boss Bold. Oh. Boss for Hom. It's a perfume Pokemon. It makes sense for it to be named after a perfume brand. So this is Hugo Boss. Now I just need to find... Oh, he's riding the team. There's Hugo Boss. Okay, so Hugo Boss is modest with healer. Uh, has Fairy Wind, Sweet Kiss, Odor Sleeve, and Echoed Voice. Not bad, Hugo Boss. I can definitely work with you. Right, you need to go into box... Number one. And uh, I need to save the game, and we are done with X and Y. That was actually pretty simple. That was actually pretty simple. To catch a Pokemon... And put it uh, and put it into X and Y. Now we can close X and Y. Now let's uh, let's load up Auras. I am playing Alpha. Uh, the game I've chosen for Auras is Alpha Sapphire. My main Alpha Sapphire save from back in 2014. This is my personal copy, so it's not got any like. It's got a few interesting things on it, but like, I'm not really... I, mean, I guess I could show you a few things I have here. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. I mean, I need to look at box... Uh, my boxes. Like, here's box one. 
There's a lot of interesting Pokemon here in box one. I'm going to have... In order to do this, I'm going to have to, like, empty box one because... Yeah. You go box four. I know that's my shiny box, but, like, you go there because it's just so much easier for me to you uh, for you to go there so I can actually get mons. But I mostly cleared this game of all my Pokemon. Didn't realize how little Pokemon I had on this game. But I don't have a lot of Pokemon on this game. Right, anyway, let's catch a po let's see if we can find a Pokemon that we can catch right here. We're in 4 Tree C, so we should be able to catch a Pokemon really easily. Okay. And to find a Pokemon, and then we need to catch it, and then we need to bring it uh, bring it with us to Sword and Shield. We need a Pokemon that's capable of being brought to Sword and Shield. Here is a Lanoon. That's capable of coming to Sword and Shield because the other, uh, the Galean Lanoons in the game. So it'll be interesting to bring in a normal Lanoon to uh, Sword and Shield. Yeah, it'd be interesting to bring a normal Lanoon to Sword and Shield. So let's do that. Oh, come on. I was going to call you Robber and everything. You were going to be awesome. Come with me, Lanoon. I'm not cat. I'm not for. I'm not going to hit you. I'm level 65. God, the Twitter's level 65. But not. I'm not hitting you with Twitter. There we go. Yes, my. Uh, um. I have a Pokemon named Twitter. It's weird. Yes, I know. All right. So this Lanoon. Should I call you? You know, I am going to call you Robber. Robber! Alright, let's go to the weather control center. Because that's the nearest place with a PC, because Robber would have been put into my team. Because I do have an empty team. Okay, so here is Robber. Level 22, Hardy Nature with Gusson for the ability, Headbutt, Odor Sleuth, uh, Mud Sport, and Fury Swipes. Okay, so that is Robber. We have our Pokemon. Let's save the game. It's getting... Uh, the quest to find Pokemon is actually getting rather simpler now it's not going to last that way forever when we get to like uh, or uh, maybe we get to diamond pearl platinum it's going to be rather interesting because like i've got to catch six pokemon transfer them to black and white to transfer them to uh, to transfer them to sort uh, to transfer them to the pokemon uh, transfer lab to transfer them to po uh, pokemon sword and shield uh, well to put transfer them to bank then home then sword and shield it's going to be a lot to go through when we get to fourth gen you know, these are sort of the easy generations. So I am done with auras, close the software. And whilst I'm doing this, uh, getting the uh, Whilst I'm getting sword and sh uh, whilst I'm getting uh, this poke game ready, let me uh, load up. Let me get sword and shield ready as well. Okay, we're gonna use the bank. Use with the use with Y. Close sword and shield. Open home. 
Wat? Yes, I want to continue using Pokemon Bank. I guess I have a mystery gift to pick up. That's what that is all about. Right, so I need to find Hugo Boss. There's Hugo Boss. You know, I'd laugh if uh, Spritzy can't come to Sword and Shield, but Slurpuff can't. I'd laugh if that's the case. I swear I've seen Spritzy in the wild area. I swear I've seen Spritzy in the wild area, so hopefully this will work. Right, so I'm going to get my key generated over here on the uh, Sword and Shield whilst we're getting this ready to go. Now to do that, in Pokemon Home, what you want to do is you want to go to the 3DS on the uh, the thing that looks at like the 3DS button on the Pokemon Home home screen, as I showed you guys in the last episode. Then we want to begin move. Move when we're ready to do... Uh, when we're ready to do this, we're gonna do. We're gonna get uh, auras ready to go as well. We're gonna go and find Robber. So, auras. I'd use my randomized copy of a uh, uh, Omega Ruby, but that's just gonna be weird to do that. Right. There is Robber. There is Hugo Boss. We are both ready to go to bank. So, you, so the game on home is warning me that I won't be able to use home until the move uh, until the move is began. So I'm going to tell it to begin. I'm gonna choose ready to get the key. Moving keys are valid for three minutes. Enter the moving key to the bank as soon as possible. Once the moving key is active, you won't be able to use uh, bank. You won't be able to go back until it expires. Are you sure? Yes. Display the key. All right. So we have our moving key. He. So basically, it generates a moving key. Uh, the game generates a moving key. Uh, Pokemon Home generates a moving key. And you have three minutes to enter the moving key on your 3DS to transfer Pokemon up. You are about to send some Pokemon to Pokemon Home. Please note that you are not. You won't be able to bring them back to Pokemon Bank. Please check the Pokemon Home website for details. That is fine. Begin. Okay, we're going to select box one where our Pokemon are. We're going to press the done button, which is the uh, Y button. Move these Pokemon to Pokemon Home. And now I have my key ready to go on my Switch. Which, which I showed you in the last episode how to get a key. So now I'm going to use this key that is pre-generated, uh, that is generated type it in and get these Pokemon to so, uh, from X and Y and Auras to Sword and Shield. This one should be quite simple because it's the exact same way as it is in uh, Pokemon uh, Sun and Moon, Ultra Sun and Moon. In the seventh generation it's the exact same way. There you go, moving key has been entered successfully. And now on the switch, it says the moving key has been entered uh, to Pokemon Bank. Your Pokemon will uh, move preparations will begin. And on here we can see, all right, time to get your Pokemon moved into their new home in, well, Pokemon Home. It uh, might take a few minutes to finish this, so sit tight. 
it depends on how many Pokemon you are moving at a time. If you're only moving a few Pokemon, it won't take that long. But of course, if you're moving a lot of Pokemon, it will take a long time. And of course, that actually took reasonably quick. So we are now done with the 3DS. So I'm going to make a cut and we'll be back in a couple of minutes where we'll go from home to Sword and Shield. Okie dokie, we are back. Gah. I'd say sorry about that, but literally I have to transition between uh, my scenes. So I'm now off the 3DS and onto my Switch. So, it's not really, it took like a couple minutes for the uh, uh, Elgato to like activate and wake up. Anyway, so we can see what it says. Preparations are complete. Move uh, preparations are complete. There are two Pokemon that can be moved. Moved. How would you like to move them uh, to Pokemon Bank? Uh, let's choose the one at a time option here this time. Pokemon in the Pokemon bank boxes will be moved one at a time at a time to fill uh, open spaces. Do you want to save your progress? Yes. Select. Um, so Pokemon were moved from Pokemon uh, from Pokemon bank to your home in Pokemon home. Yay. So now if we look at home, we go to our we go to our Pokemon, we go to Pokemon, we select the game we want to use, which is Sword. We want to connect to this game. Now we need to find our Pokemon. Here is Spritzy. Spritzy has Odor Sleuth, which is not available in Sword and Shield. Okay. So I will bring over Spritzy. I know that Spritzy has an unconfirmed move. That's fine. We'll sort that out at a later date. Odor Sleuth is not available. I get that. Now I just need to find where is the noon? Where is robber? Where is robber? I think I just go to the newest thirty to find him. There he is, Robber. Robber has mud. Uh, Robber has mud sport and odor sleuth as well, which again cannot be used in sword and shield. But that's perfectly fine. So we'll bring them in, and now we are done with bank. We can save. Would you like to save? I would like to save. Okay, we are done with Pokemon Bank. We can close Pokemon Bank now. And go into Sword and Shield. So you just select the Pokemon from Bank and drag it over to Sword and Shield. The PC box is at Sword and Shield's PC boxes. And there you go. That is, as long as you save, you are done. That is literally the entire process in Pokemon Home. Okay, so here I am in the wild area. And I'm going to go back to Wedgehurst. Is 
to show these Pokemon off in battle, and then I will also make them, well, legal. So we'll show off that, uh, we'll show off that feature again. So let's find box number one. There we go, box number one. There's Hugo Boss. There's Robber. Let's take a look at these Pokemon. So as we can see, uh, Hugo Boss has the Pentagon here to show that he uh, has come from X and Y. A, a come, and so has Robert, because again, they both came from the seventh gener sixth generation. But if we check the notes here, we can see that this uh, Pokemon has travelled across time to the Hoenn region, uh, from the Hoenn region. This Pokemon, and as we can see here from uh, Hugo Boss, has travelled across time uh, to join us from the Kalos region. So that's rather cool. And as we can see from the other Pokemon we have transferred in from Pokemon uh, Sun and Moon in the last episode of the transfer uh, of the transfer guide, this Pokemon joined us from the Alola region. Made it. It seems this Pokemon has travelled all the way across space and time itself to join us from the Alola region. And there we can see that exact same thing with Wendy, our lone Vulpex. And we can see it. We can see it from Eddie here, who travelled from space and time from the Kanto region. So there we go. That is uh, that is that. We've shown that those Pokémon have travelled across space and time to join us right here in this re in the Kalos region in the. G yeah, right here where we are in Sword and Shield. In the Gala region. There we go. The Gala region. God damn it, Joe. Why you forget? Right. So let's show off these Pokemon in battle. Here is a Blipbug. Go, Hugo Boss. Hugo Boss. Fairy Wind. Beautiful. So there we go, that is Hugo Boss in battle. I'll show him again here against this Squirlet. Because that lasted too quickly. So you can see there's Squirlet. Uh, there's our Squirlex. There's our opponent. And there's, there's Hugo Boss. And we'll use Fairy Wind. Whoa, this one lived. Okay. You were beefy, Squirtlet. You were beefy. You took a Fairy Wind. From something that's seven levels ahead of you. And we'll show off Echo Voice as well. Nice. Okay, so that is Hugo Boss. Let's show off Robber. Our Hoenn Lanoon. Yeah, our Holon. Should I say it? Because it's Gal. It's a Galean Lanoon. This is a Holonian Lanoon. Because he comes from the Hoenn region. So Holonely in the Noon or something like that. 
Or, should, or would it be just the noon? Because normal the noons that f not from the Gala region look like this. I don't know. But we'll show it off. Uh, we'll show off against this wild yamper again. So here's Robber. Let's see Robber from the front, please, game. When you're in your own time. There we go. So that is Robber. And yep, so let's use Fury swipes this time, please. Nice. Guaranteed to hit twice, so still guaranteed to kill. Okay, so there we go. That is Robber and Hugo Boss in battle. Let's set up camp. So we can see uh, we can see Robber here. Easy attack the toy. Okay. We'll change to the ball. Go and get it, Robber. There we go. Robber seems to be worried about its surroundings. Robber is excited about its new place. Robber is looks very happy. Robber seems a bit bored. Go and fight. See you later, Robber. Let's see if we can get a uh, spritzy over here. There we go. You come over here, please, Spritzy. So here is Spritzy. There we go. Attack the toy. And... Can we get the ball, please? Hugo Boss seems to be a bit nervous. Hugo Boss is excited. Hugo Boss looks like it wants to play. I threw you the ball. Go and get it. Thank you, Hey Haji. Thank you for getting me the ball. Out the way, hey Haji. I'm trying to play with. I'm trying to play with a Hugo Boss here. There we go. You picked up the ball. Good, good Hugo Boss. Go and get it again. There we go. Good Hugo Boss. Hugo Boss is a bit hesitant. But Hugo Boss is excited. Nice. So that is Hugo Boss. Can we bring... I want... To... Can I talk to you... Robber is a bit hesitant. I was thinking like maybe they'd have some like kind of conversation. There we go. 
Robert and Hugo Boss seem to be a bit puzzled by each other. Robert and Hugo Boss don't know uh, what to do. Don't seem to know what to do. Hugo Boss and Robert seem puzzled by each other. Go and play. Okay, so that, ladies and gentlemen, is the transfer guide from getting Pokemon to... from Sword and Shield... Well, from Pokemon from X and Y, Aura, and Alpha Sapphire Omega Ruby to Sword and Shield. If you liked the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. In the next episode, we're going to be looking at the fifth generation, Pokemon Black, White, Pokemon Black 2, and White 2 as well. And see how simple, or how not simple, not so simple, I should say, it is to transfer Pokemon from that generation to Sword and Shield. But until next time, I'm Lantern Joe. You have been watching an episode of the Pokemon Tr Home Transfer Guide. And I will see you next time. Mean to the Pokemon get to Lazar. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And of course, you can ring the bell and you'll be notified first when those videos come out, you can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me, Joe, and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you're a fan of this sort of thing, then you might like Power Zone Metal, a radio show presented by me and my brother Dan, aka the Gentleman of Metal. You can find out more information about that on PowerZoneMetal.uk. And of course, if you want to watch more videos, you can watch them by clicking in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. And of course, until next time, from me, Joe, and from the rest of the Lantern Nation, we'll see you again.